four, three, two, one. After a smooth launch, the Starship SN8 had successfully reached an altitude of 12.5 kilometers, but it later landed in a huge explosion. Mitigating expectations for the launch, SpaceX said it was a good step in its effort to build a fully reusable transportation system. Its CEO Elon Musk congratulated the team for collecting the data it needed. Musk made headlines earlier this month announcing an ambitious timeline for a landing on Mars. I feel fairly confident about uh, six years from now. So every, the, the Mars, uh, Earth-Mars synchronization occurs roughly every 26 months. So we had one this year, the summer, and uh, so that means in roughly like about two years there'll be another one, um, and uh, then two years after that. So I think, I'd say if you say six years from now, I think highly confident. Uh, if we get lucky, maybe four years. But there are other challenges for a mission to the Red Planet. Okay, let's do the math. I gotta figure out how to grow four years worth of food here on a planet where nothing grows. The plot of the 2015 Hollywood adventure film The Martian depicts the challenges of growing food on Mars. Actual research is being carried out at the University of Guelph in Canada, where researchers are looking at ways to grow food in special chambers simulating Mars conditions in an effort to sustain life in space. Among the, the overriding questions is the search for life. And uh, you heard it here first, but I'm pretty confident that we will find some form of microbial fossilized life uh, in, a, in the deep frozen lakes of Mars. The exploration mission to achieve that is going to be kind of long term, uh, will require a lot of resources, and a lot of people. And setting foot on the Red Planet will also raise many questions about how it will be governed. Musk's recent suggestion that SpaceX would make its own laws on Mars is criticized by experts of the International Outer Space Treaty. Space is not the property of any one company or any country. It is what is in legal term, it is called area beyond national jurisdiction. Any progress made by SpaceX in its mission to land on Mars brings a lot of excitement to scientists around the world, as new discoveries could answer many questions about life and open up wide-ranging possibilities in space. But as the historic moment draws closer, that curiosity also comes with some caution from those who worry about issues of global safety and accountability.